I put on clothes. <laughs> I mean, I did, I did at the, I did at the end. But yeah, no, it's true. Uh, although we may have still. already been faded out into our end slate at that point, but yay, Noni is uh, is is clean. Quite possibly for the first time since she left her cryo chamber. Yeah, that's true. That's the first shower I've ever had, ever in this new world. In this world, yes, it, since the apocalypse. I took off my sack mask so people would be able to uh, identify with me a little more. Yeah, yeah. The goggles have, like, were just not gonna. We're not gonna broach that subject. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> the goggles are fine. Yeah, no. They protect my eyes from yeah. radiation. And and God only knows how much radiation and and other um, harmful to the retinas shit there is going on around here. So. Exactly. So all they have to deal with is my metal equipment and this dead woman's dress. That's yes, all. Yes. Yes. And nobody knows she's dead. It's well, except maybe Nick. Oh yeah. They seemed pretty maybe. close. Maybe Nick. Yeah. But well, I'm never gonna see him again. That's true. Yeah. For all <laughs> you care, he. Yeah. Anyway, so oh. you have more things to take care of. That's that's father. That's Shayun. Spoiler alert, um, and uh, yeah, you, your your quest, should you choose to accept it, I guess, is to go schmooze with some of the local. Um... <laughs> Can you really imagine what life would be like if people behaved like they did while playing video games? Like you're go up to look at something, and somebody like <laughs> picks up a clipboard and just like reaches over above your head and just drops it right in front of you. Fucking, I mean, no, you're behaving like a cat, you know? It's like you're just <laughs> knocking things off of desks and waving things in front of people's faces. It's great. It's wonderful. My my disappointment can't be measured. No, it's true. Finding out that my son is an old man mm -hmm. who wants to take over the... Wait a minute. Yeah? He wants to take over the universe. Or at least the Commonwealth. Well, the Commonwealth, yeah. You know, you know what? It, it's a starting point. I maybe, uh -huh. just maybe, we're not that different. He's a little chip off the old block. Maybe he's more like me than I think. That's true. That's true. You know, <laughs> huh? Yeah. Okay. I uh, you can I get... can get behind this. Ugh, these people are my people. Oh, look at that guy! Yeah, Dude, and they're synth. they're treating you with with well earned respect. Oh, okay, all right. You know what? What's up? I can maybe get behind this. You're a synth. Look at you. Yeah, that's a pretty pretty um, convincing synth, I would say. I love this place. Yeah, I'm starting to love this place. Yeah, I'm not clean gonna tell Sean that, walls. Though. Probably smells a lot better here than it does out in the Commonwealth. Oh man, yeah, it smells like cleanliness here. And you know what? Since no bo. Whoa, hey now. Oh jeez, did you just make it all the way back up to the top? <laughs> My to jump's fall. pretty hardcore. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Well, that's the thing, but... right? It's like you have super powered jumping, but unfortunately, uh, you're not very good at at like modulating that height. Good for hey, you, Julia. Julia Thompson. Listen, Julia. Uh, are you a synth or are you a real kid? Well, hello. Hi. Isn't it wonderful here? Yeah. Yeah. I'm out of here. Good Creepy for you, kids. Julia. I well, like this I mean, place. But yeah. All okay, right, so who so, am I supposed to talk to? I wasn't paying attention. Yeah, you have a few people that you should be talking to. It'll probably be easiest if you can uh, just turn on the quest so that you can find them using the uh, uh, the compass markers. All right. Yeah. Uh, institutionalized, I believe. Yes, is the one. And just made will turn inside job off altogether. There you go. Done and done. Oh, look at all this. So many options. If people yep, to you got to talk to like three or four people. So just follow... The dots, and they'll take you where you need to go. There's so many dots. 
Yep, that one's that one's fairly close. Maybe we'll go to that one first. We'll go to this one first. Hey, how you doing? I want a helmet like you. <laughs> you probably get one if you if you ask nicely for it. Maybe I'll just beat one. up a synth and take it. That's true. They're not human. Jeez, you're a courser. I could beat you guys up no problem. Yeah. <laughs> Shut up. I'm here now. <laughs> <laughs> hey, conversation. Zip it. We're going to be keeping a close eye on you for the near Fantastic, Justin. You're a bit of an unknown quantity. Yeah. I'm sure you understand. Yeah, no. There won't be any issues, will there? Yes, absolutely. Hmm. Hmm. Stay out of my way, or you'll regret it. That sounds a bit like a threat. I'm sure I'm just misunderstanding you, though. Threats aren't advisable for someone in your position. You mean somebody with super strength? <laughs> somebody who could liquefy you with a one punch? Or, or a badly timed sneeze. Yeah. <laughs> so, basically, you're the secret police. Secret police? If that's a pre-war reference, then I'm afraid it's lost on me. Our main instrument is the Corsair, a third-generation synth assigned to operate on the surface. Fantastic. Corsairs hunt down and reclaim... I notice this guy isn't Dr. Justin. He's just Justin. <laughs> yep, just Justin. <laughs> Intern Justin. In a word, a this guy's an, a jerk. But I gather you know he is. Think you've been telling me already. In fact, I'd very much like to know how you defeated him. Oh. Punched the shit out of it. I hate to break it to you, but the Corsair <laughs> wasn't all that bad. <laughs> then it's likely the unit was defective. It's rare, but faults can occur from time to time. All of them are defective, then. diagnostic on the entire production line. As if you don't need anything else. Now, unless you need something else, I'll get back to work. Um, um... Yeah, just, I'm good for now, thanks. Probably a good way to just get this guy out of your hair. I'm good for now. Thanks. Yeah. I don't I mean, care about you. You've got work to do. <laughs> I've got important things to do, and I don't care about you at all, Justin. No. Next next time Just, I see you, Justin I might is, liquefy is, your uh, head. Justin is a classic Bethesda dickhead. Yeah. Huh. All right. Is there somebody in here? Oh, yeah. It certainly yeah. looks like it. Look at this guy. Yellow frock. Reminds you of my husband. How you doing? Hey, Doc. I'm concerned. The phase out on these older models can't come soon enough. They weren't kidding. I don't know. You really are here. Most of them have well, all right. <laughs> the person's still trying to talk to Allie. <laughs> he is the Institute's chief engineer. When Father told us about you, I could hardly believe it. You've been through so much. I think most people would have just given up. Huh. If you don't mind my asking, what was it that kept you going all that time? Yeah. I uh I wanted to kill the son of a bitch who murdered my husband. That's true. Alec always was a cold. <laughs> if you ask me, we're better off without him. Come on. I'll give you a quick rundown of the facilities division, and then I'll answer any questions you might have afterward. As you might guess, we keep the institute's mechanical and electrical systems running smooth. Yeah. We maintain and upgrade all of the This is interesting. Possible to <laughs> Thanks, Sally. There's a lot of machinery mm. these walls. Can you imagine you just reaching over and just ending her and walking away? <laughs> the work we do might not be No, she's alright. She's boring, but... Yeah. Uh, boring, boring, but not hindering. Yeah, yeah. Uh, uh, what? I wasn't paying attention. <laughs> You're just spacing out. Yeah, Absolutely. why not? Absolutely. Good to hear. It'll be a load off Sean's mind. Take your time. Get yourself acquainted. There's a lot to take in. Plenty of things you won't find topside. Yeah, I bet. If there's anything else you'd like to know about the facilities division, I'm happy to discuss it. Great. Well, the showers already uh, have been the uh, a good item in the uh, things you won't find topside uh, area. So. As the Institute's requisition vendor, I can provide supplies for your missions on the surface. How may I assist? Supplies. <laughs> Quaint. Well, you know. Some people need them. Some not people every, do not need them. Not everybody can just 
destroy the world with a fucking errant hand swing. No, that's true. Alright, I think I'm gonna have to go up a floor to talk to the next person. Feels like it, doesn't it? The next two. Just as you gave life to father, he gave life to many of us. Uh -huh. Thank Great. you, creepy synth guy. Creepy synths. Mm-hmm. Oh, you're in somebody's room. Ah, there you go. Oh. That was not um, the... Um. Eh, just, just jump. When in doubt, just <laughs> take the, the route of least resistance. Hey, now. Here we go. There you go. You're, you're nonying your way through the Institute quite well. <laughs> I'm glad they have a nice open space for me to jump to the top of. Yes, yes. So you can get around any uh, possible obstacles. Look at that. <laughs> look at that guns. Oh, lady right after your own heart. Yeah. <laughs> I took an institute pistol. <laughs> uh, you know. What are they gonna do? You can what pistol whip somebody with here? it. That was productive. It's really exciting having you here. I can't wait to see what you can do. Yeah. Great. Uh those apparently physically hinder oh. you. Oh oh here here. Yeah, this is the person to to talk to Madison Lee. Excuse me, Doctor. Ah, it's you. You're here then. Yes, yes, I know who you are. We all do. While I'm sure Father is very happy that you're here, I do hope it doesn't interrupt our Too work. late. I already interrupted your work. <laughs> well, that's insulting. I'm, I'm sorry. Not my intention. There's just quite a bit going on right now, and your arrival has the potential to throw things off schedule. Oh, before I forget, let me see that pit boy of yours. Um... I've been told to install a coarser chip in it for you father's orders were to be given full access with the ability to relay in and out of the institute at will that's nifty yeah without the need for the help of the uh, Thank uh you. minute man i'm sure that will come in handy given that the relay is the only way to access the institute handy is something of an oh answer. she's a uh... case the significance is lost on you you'll be the only one here with that kind of access i see if nothing else it should demonstrate the amount of trust father has placed in you now Unless there's something else, I really do need to get back to work. She was a lot, ni a lot nicer in Fallout 3. I'm good for now. Thanks. All right. I'm pretty yeah. sure that's the same Dr. Madison Lee that delivered you in Fallout 3. How did she end up here? Uh, well, there's a whole side plot thing in Rivet City in Fallout 3 that has to do with the Institute, so I'm assuming it has something to do with that. I'm imagining that Noni's enjoying that. <laughs> I got a whole bunch of robot army people. Yeah, just a, a bunch of, to... uh, of of robotic fucking bootlegs just this is lining awesome. up to 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 kiss your ass. I'm in. Yeah, I'm in. This is this is training me for the future when everyone will be doing <laughs> when it. You're, when you're the queen empress of the <laughs> of the galaxy. You're not important. You're not important. You're apparently important. Shut up and talk to me. <clears throat> oh. Hello, Clayton. Damn. So you work with the plants, huh? I look forward to learning more about it. Oh man, you just you just volunteered to get more information. I might have a thing for Clayton. Oh. I see that Noni's going back to her old Stardew Valley days. <laughs> That's okay. It's okay. There's nothing specifically wrong with that. <laughs> the creepy thing is, um, your son probably watched this guy grow up. Yeah, whatever. <laughs> I still got needs. It's true. And this is this guy's the best looking guy in the entire Commonwealth. It's quite possible. I'm sure I've taken up enough of your time as it is. But I have to ask, have you decided whether you'll join us? 
I'm not sure how well I'll fit in, but I'd like to give it a try. Great. I was hoping you'd say him. Yeah, yeah. In any case, I imagine you'll want to continue looking around. Or if you prefer, I'd be happy to answer. Look at this guy. He's friendly. Mm hmm. I'm good for now. Thanks. Take care then. Friendly. Uh, willing to not bore you with additional un unnecessary shit. And he makes robotic gorillas. Wonder what he's carrying. It's a good question. You might. Let's find out. Well, it's just fusion Whoops. cells. You can see already. Uh, he's just. He's he's fine. I like him. Yeah. No, he's a decent dude. I I just wanted to see what was in his pockets. No big yep. deal. Fusion cells. Fusion cells. Ammo fusion for cell. uh, ammo for a laser gun. Yeah. That's a weird, kind of a weird. I mean, it's not that weird. Yeah, I mean, I'm sure you carry around. Well, you all, you just, you are a fucking lethal weapon. So there's that. But I don't think anyone's supposed to be up here. <laughs> no, I'm pretty sure that this was not in, an intended walkable zone. I mean, I'm sure huh. that no, actually, I, that probably isn't a, a logically normal way to get up there. Yeah. It's probably just something you're meant to see while you're going down the elevator. Huh. So I guess I should go, uh... I should go see someone. Uh, it's above me. Whoa. Right above me. All yeah, right. yeah. I'll go over here. A little, yeah, then, through that Oh, wall. in that there, room. You probably just want to take the stairs up, or you could leap through an open window. <laughs> you know, one or the other. Oh, you're back at, at Father's. Hey, father's Clone workout. Sean. Hey, hey, hey clone buddy. Child. You all right? Oh, father's moving around. You're gonna have to. You go have to go up the stairs where the. Um, I wonder if yeah. he's taking a shower. That would be. Oh awkward. no, there he is. Now that you've had a chance Remember to, to conserve power change. at every opportunity. What do you think? Head explode. <laughs> 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 Uh You've got technology here that I never dreamed possible. It's amazing. I'm glad you can appreciate what we've accomplished. That chair looks uncomfortable. It does. Ultimately, all our knowledge and resources are focused on a single goal. The goal is best summarized by our motto. Mankind redefined. Unfortunately, no advancement comes without patience. Mankind redified. Uh, redified. As in bloody mist. Oh my god. Shut up. Um. <laughs> what do you mean by proper supervision? I mean that while they are here in the Institute, fulfilling the purpose for which they were designed, mm -hmm. as you're about to see, however, they can be. A rogue synth has taken over the Raider gang at Libertalia. Oh, yeah. He has been erased, and his identity altered. He believes he's a man named Gabriel. Oh, dear. Under his leadership, the Raiders have taken many innocent lives. I've dispatched a courser to Libertalia. I'd like you to join him and reclaim that synth. It might not want to talk. It would be safer just to kill it. That would be a terrible waste of a valuable resource. If at all possible, that synth should be returned alive. Not a chance. Now you should get moving. Many people are in danger. Yeah. And a delay could cost lives. Yeah. Not a chance, Father. Well, you know, there there's bound to be points where your opinions and his are not going to be fully lined up. But, you know, it's fine. We All right, have a where's job this to courser? Do. Uh, I guess yeah, I, I guess now we're... that you have the courser chip, you can just fast travel in and out of the institute at will. So, um, yeah, next stop, Libertalia, and uh, reclaiming a synth. Has done remarkable things. I would not exist were it not for him. I think they forgot to put the top of your hair on. You. You are disturbing. Bye. <laughs> yeah. Oh, look at another one. Another one. Operating at full capacity. Uh, come here. It's a janitor here. bot. Uh, what, do you, what do you taste like? What does your head taste like? Probably rubber. 
We'll see you next time, everybody. Yeah, bye, everybody. More robot licking next time. How do I get out of here?